Hey guys, this is Early1981 and welcome back to the Golf Club 2. I would just like to say a huge congratulations to Old Time Gamer 1957 who won the Hackers Paradise Open. If you could message me either on YouTube or on the PSN uh, regarding uh, at selecting an event and a course for the Hackers Paradise Society, uh, Old Time Gamer, that would be much appreciated. So today I am going to do... Uh, live commentary and live gameplay of my round here. It's obviously on the Hackers Paradise Society and we are going to play the Thai Web Cash Builder. Now for those of you um, golf fanatics, you'll probably know who Ty Webb is. He was the probably the main character in Caddyshack, uh, played by Chevy Chase. So let's pay my entry fee and begin round one. I am warmed up. I did do a live uh, course review on the channel, so I have had a, a warm up round. Thanks to everyone who hung out in the live stream with me, it's much appreciated. These damn loading screens. Hopefully, that's another thing they fix in a patch is the loading screens. Some of them take severely long, a lot longer than they should take. So the society is uh, just past 150 members, guys. Absolute fantastic. Uh, good luck to everyone who is uh, playing in this event. Myself and my admins will be doing our best to ensure there is no uh, hackers playing in these events. So if you're a hacker, please don't even consider joining the, the event or the society. Wow, and apologies for this loading screen, guys. There, there's nothing I can do here. I'm recording live. I'm just afraid that it's taking so long to load up. So, we're on the first heat. Five mile per hour wind. I can hit the, the big burfa. Let's get the big boy out. Perfect, perfect. Straight as a die. Like I say, I have had a warm up round. Hopefully, I've got all my swing tempo fluffs um, out and done with. So that has left me 124 yards with a one behind me. Look at that green, Jesus. Just checking the green speeds actually. So we are on winter green course. Uh, winter Green Golf Club, guys. So the greens are medium. Thankfully. So let's loft this pitching wedge up. Due to the wind being behind us. That's a decent strike. Oh, I'm short, short and left, really short and left. So, gives me a birdie opportunity, but it's going to be a tough one. The current leader, I think, is seven under, which is a good round, but it's beatable. Especially in this course, that's not turning. Good way to pat, though. I do feel seven under could be absolutely smashed on this course, guys, but it's a good, uh, a good start. A good uh, score to aspire to beat. So as you can see, it's Ace 0707 who is uh, top of the leaderboard currently. I think this event has just went live. So it's a par 3. I have only played this course once before, guys, and I really enjoyed it. Hence why it's on the society. And look at the green, though. Wow. You want to get this close. Or you could be in all kinds of trouble. So I do feel the A iron is the club. Just going to take a bit of loft off it. Add a bit of distance onto this. Uh, maybe push that a wee bit left. But it's bang on. Go on, roll on, roll on. 
That's a great shot, and that should be a birdie opportunity. Well, it will be a birdie opportunity, but it should be an easy birdie opportunity. Says there's no breaks on it. I just double check and triple check now, guys. I'm happy with that, that that's flat. So, I managed to get to one under. Let's move on to hole three. Six shots off the lead. And it's great to have the crowds in this event. It does add a little something different to the game. Can I get past this with a wind against me? Yeah, I'm sure I can. Let's hug this tree as tight as I can. That's my line. Should get over the tree, no problem. I do. Should be in the middle of the fairway. It is. Delighted with that. And like I say, it is nice to have the crowds enabled in courses, guys. It just adds a different atmosphere. It fucking drones... Uh, it means you don't have to listen to John's drivel. I do have the, the sound effects and the commentary down low, though, so you can hear yours truly. So, uh, I'm not going for this in two hours, am I? Yeah, let's go for it. Stuff it. Looks good in flight. I do feel I'm going to be long, though. Yeah, I'm going to be way long. Was a tough pin. Was a tough pin. I did for 0 0.05 seconds. Consider laying up. So I've got an eagle opportunity, 25 foot. It's actually makeable putt, to be fair. Greens are lightning fast, 187. Have I put enough on that? It needs to turn. Hello, hello. Oh! Why? That needs to stop. That needs to stop. Jesus. So I've left myself a 9 foot birdie putt. This is certainly no gimme. Can't believe that ball went so far past. And I managed to sink the birdie just, guys, just on the outside edge. And that is going to take me to two under. So far, so good. Played three holes. Two under. Let's move on to hole four, which is a par four. It looks a short par four. I'm sure I can hold this with a driver with a wind in my face. No, maybe I can't. Just going to play safe here, guys, and take my one iron. Try and leave myself a de decent yardage. Ideally, I leave my pitching wedge here. That's what I'm looking for. Unless I've really got my calculations badly mixed up. I haven't. There we go. Pitching wedge. Just lofting this up. That wind, 8 mile per hour left. Just give it a new extra bit for my draw shots. This could be decent. Could be decent. Ah, uh, just a wee bit short. Just a wee bit short. 14 footer for birdie. Look at that sun. It's glaring right in my eyes. Turn. Oh, just turn too much. So, I'll have about a four foot putt for part. Yeah, four foot bang on. So, unfortunately, it is only a part. I need to start getting more birdies to put a challenge on ace. 0707. Yes, Miss Money Penny. So, hole five. Once again, quite a short par four. Wind is blowing the opposite direction this time. Oh, and I've pushed that left. I'm okay though. I am okay. It is going left. I am going to hold the fairway though, guys. So it's a fair drive, 301 yards to be exact. So once again, it's a pitching wedge. Everson seems to be a, a drive and a pitching wedge so far. 
just taking a wee bit off of this. Didn't like how much I took off of that there. So let's just adjust it with the wind accordingly. Oh, that's a straight shot. Am I going to be rewarded? That is really, really straight. And this could be really bang on the money. It is. Great shot. Probably going to be about five foot from the pin. Four foot. Done myself out a foot there. Just breaking slightly to the left. Let's just drill this in. Take the break out. So I moved to three under. So I'm only four shots behind now, guys. Let's move on to hole six, which is a par three. Why? Look at the wind. I've really got the wind behind me now. So this is going to cause all kind of pro. I've got to go. Yeah, I'm going to have to play my gap wedge and hope the wind takes me that yardage. The extra yardage. I'm just jacking up a wee bit because I do feel otherwise I'm going to be too long. Very straight shot again. I'm really playing well and this could be nice. Don't spin back. Beautiful shot. So can I continue this birdie train? Really swinging well. That's what happens when you have a warm up. Oh, I thought I missed that guys. I honestly thought I missed that. That ball did not break at all. So four under. Nine mile per hour wind behind me in my favour. So let, hopefully I can smash this down here. And I might, well not might, I should have an opportunity to hit the green in two. But we'll see. Oh I've put a fast on that. I have put a fast on that. But I am swinging deadly, deadly straight. And frankly it's quite a forgiving fairway. 312 yards we've nailed that down the fairway. Seven. So yeah, I'm going to hit my hybrid here, guys. I'm going to let the wind do its job and see if we can get this running up towards the pin. Um, th that is another deadly straight. Ah, come on, bounce on. Ah, it's going to be long. It's going to be a long, sh longer than what I'd hoped. I hope to get that closer than that and give myself a real chance on eagle. But I think the last three shots are three of the straightest shots I've played. And they've not turned out great, so there you go. So 25 foot putt. Breaking both ways. I'd say it's breaking slightly more to the left. Stay up. Stay up. Stay up. Oh, that just trick. That must have just trickled by by centimetres. So I tell you what, this actually went a wee bit further past than what I hope. Seven feet. Slightly slight break to the left. Oh Lee. And that might come back and bite my arse that one guys. That's a bad bad mess for a birdie. So unfortunately it's just a par. That oh, was a three putt par. Comfortably on the green and two as well. Poor pun. So why this a really short par four? Surely I can drive this. I, I'm gonna not gonna hit my driver though. I don't want to put a slow on this, and I ah, it's gonna be quite tricky because I'm gonna have to aim out into the water, let the wind do its magic. Shit! I have hit my driver. It's gonna be long, guys. I I did not mean to hit my driver there. It was only on my downswing I've realised that that is my driver. Anyways, doesn't matter, I've got an 8 yard chip. Can we chip it in? Go on. Go on. Go on. Nah, very happy with that shot though. It's probably going to be about a 5 foot putt for birdie. 4 foot. Nothing much to this. So... Makes up for the the par on the par five, so I am now five under through nine. So actually, Ace Double O Seven O Seven score is actually looking not too bad. Good shot. It's not deadly straight, but it should hold the fairway. 
and it did right in the centre of the field. So 143 yards, green slightly above me, slight elevation to it. Let's go for the 8 iron because the wind is quite severely in my face, 7 mile per hour, that will affect it. Once again, very straw, straight, very straight. Oh, I'm long. I am long. Wow, way long. Thirteen foot. I was hoping to be a lot. It's still a good shot, but I was hoping to be dialed in a lot closer than that, guys. Turn. I've not hit it ever. Oh, it did get there. I didn't think it was. I unfortunately never read the the break. So it's just another part. So I'm gonna have to maybe see if I can play a bit better this back nine guys. So this is a short par five, especially the wind in my favour. Let's open this up. Big generous fairway again here. Good swing, as you're seeing, as I do 9 times out of 10, push it left, draw it left. So what's this now leaving me? 218 yards, uphill, do you feel it's going to be the hybrid again with the wind in my favour? Just took a touch off of it, put a bit of extra loft on it, see if we can float this into the green, get it running up onto it. Swinging really, really well. This could be decent. Ah, oh, that's going to roll off. Yeah. So, little chip shot. Let's see if we can get this close, lofting it right up. Turn, turn, oh, it's just going to be a tapping birdie. So, it's another bird. So, I'm now six under for the round, six under for the event, only one shot behind the leader now. Let's see if I can turn the screw. I am not hitting the driver here, guys. I think the safe bet is to lay up. Last time I did hit my driver here, I went right through the green, almost into the water. I did have a headwind, though. Yeah, I'm going to play smart here, guys. See if I can hopefully hit this straight. Yeah, happy with that. Wind should take me round. Oh, I don't like how that came back. Oh, I've pushed that a wee bit left of her. Nah, it's going to be fine. Wind's taking me around nicely. And that should just be short of the green, I would imagine. There is a lip there. It probably won't roll up. No, it's not. So, it's going to be a short chip shot. 17 yards. Up one foot. Ideally, I should be able to get this close. Got the luxury of really swinging at it. Go on. Go on. Oh, and once again, the chip shot just doesn't drop. I think that's three chip shots we've had. They've all been very close. Whoa, badly put. But that was a bad putt there. I pushed that so far right. So I am joint top of the leaderboard with Ace. Let's see now if I can go and put a score right there and get guys chasing that. This is a long par 3. Once again, it's my go-to club, the hybrid. Just taking a bit of loft off of it, extra distance. 10 mile per hour wind to the right. Wind's taking me, pardon me, wind's taking me round. Is it going to get there? It's decent, maybe it just took a bit too much off of it. Oh, that's coming back off the green. Okay, so this is now going to be a, wow, stop, this is now going to be a tough birdie putt, it's quite a challenge to get par here, 
31 feet, Jesus. So that was a bad shot. I'm just hoping to get this up onto that slope and then come off the slope and run down towards the pin. Easier said than that. Now that should start sloping off. Go on, get in, get in. Happy with that. From that situation, I would have took a par, which I should thankfully get. So, stay at seven under. Can't I play the big boy here? Should be able to. If I go left, the wind should take me round. Yeah, I'm happy that I can play the driver here. Try and take some of the distance out of this par four. Once again, good swing. I put a fast perfect in it, but it doesn't really affect the swing at all. Go on, run on down, run on down. 293 yards, so it should be quite a short approach shot now. Once again, it's a, it's a trusty pitching wedge. I should be able to get this zeroed in here, guys, despite this slope. One, yeah, may have a look at the green, actually. Nothing really there. Okay, so let's take the slope into consideration. once for me. Oh, it's decent. It's decent. Probably going to be about a nine foot putt for Barry. Seven. Oh, and this is very, very makeable. I'll be devastated if I don't make this. There we go. And I'm now out on the lead myself at eight under. Playing solid golf. So far, no bogeys. in this, I can't recall there being so many par 5's just going to use the wind try to hug the right hand side of this fairway as much as I can I've pushed that left you know I wanted to really stay on the right hand side of the fairway probably going to find the centre because as you can see the green's just up there very good drive again, swinging well happy with the way I'm swinging Hmm. Okay. Let's go for it. See if the wind's going to take me round towards the pin. Wind's not really taking me round at all. Oh, that's a horrible kick. That was a horrible kick. And look at that. We would have been pin high to. Not to worry. It's another chip shot. Surely one of these chip shots are going to drop for me. This is a tougher one, though. No. Just looking to get this close. Oh, it's in. It's in. Boom. There's an eagle. I did say one of these chip shots were going to drop. Sorry, I'm now nine under. Ten under. Sorry, ten under. Three shots in the lead now myself. Let's see if we can get that. Let's get another two birdies. If I can get another two birdies, I'll be delighted. Oh, it's going left for days. Thankfully, it is for giving fairways. Is it going to hold? Yeah, it is. It's actually worked out very for fortunate for me. Wow, and I got away with one there, guys. So, it's just going to be my lob wedge. Going to add a bit of extra distance onto this due to the wind. Let's see, I'm just going to shoot right at the pin. Just shooting right at the pin here. How's that went so far left? Seriously? Oh, no. Didn't want as much backspin as that. I can't believe that ball went so far left. So it's a 14 foot putt for birdie. Very makeable once again. It's looking good. Turn. Boom. 11 under. Three shots in the lead, four shots in the lead currently.
Let's get out the boomstick. Let's get over this bunker. Fairly straight. It's going to find the fairway anyway, and this should be a this should be a, just like a pitch shot into the green now, I'd imagine. 75 yard pitch. 65 yard pitch. Okay, 69 yards. Oh, I'm just going to have to take a bit of loft off of this, guys, because I do feel I'm going to hit the fringe. I'm definitely hitting the fringe here. Hopefully it can shoot out for me, though. Guarantees I'm hitting the fringe of the green. Yeah, there we go. Oh, it's nice. Oh, and it's checked up. Just beautiful. Hopefully this is another birdie, then. This could put me to 12 under. I would be delighted to finish at 12 under. There we go. Two holes to play. 12 under. I'm absolutely eating this course up now. The par threes are really, really long in this course. I can, f yeah. It's gonna have to be the one iron, guys. The wind is in my favour. I am just putting a bit of loft on this because this club runs for days on fast greens. It's a decent swing. Ah, it's gonna be long. It's gonna be way long. Shit. So despite lofting up. Just on the fast greens, it's not going to bite. It's probably going to run off the edge of the green. It is. So, that's quite a poor shot. We'll take par it out. Well, I'd actually take a birdie. Let's see if we can work one of our wonder chips again. It's breaking right. Go on, go on, go on. We've done it again! And my chip shots are probably the best I've ever been in a round. Wow, 13 under. So let's move on to the 18th, guys. 13 under. Six shots in the lead now. Oh, and it's a fast. And I've pushed it a wee bit left. Wow, that must be a huge fairway because I have, I have hit the centre of the fairway there. I don't think I was as punished accordingly there, to be honest. That's, I have gotten away with that, to be fair. Now, this is a tough, very tough approach shot. I don't want to be right or put a perfect slow on this. 173 is down, so yeah. Seven irons a club. Oh, and I got a swing glitch, but look at that. It went perfectly straight. This could be nice. Go on. Get in. Get in. Oh. Damn, that ball's trickled a wee bit further past than what I hoped. It's going to be about a seven foot putt for birdie. Six foot putt for birdie. And this is to go 14 under. Which I did shoot, shoot the very first time I played this. Yes. So there you go, guys. 14 under for the first round. Like I say, good luck to everyone playing the, the Hackers Paradise Society uh, event, which is a Thai web cash builder. If you enjoyed this video, guys, and you're new to my channel, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you all very shortly in the next video. Take care. Peace out.